everyone, welcome to a come shop with me video. Today we're going to be popping into a few homeware shops because I need a few bits and bobs and I thought I'd take you along for the day. I want to go to Primark first, so I'm actually in Bournemouth Town Centre and I'm going to go in there, have a look at the homeware, maybe have a look at the other stuff as well. I'm actually wearing this dress today again. <laughs> I wore this last time I was in the car in a vlog, this is from Primark. So I want to have a little look, see what they've got in and specifically their homeware and then i'm thinking of going down to dunelm and maybe matalan see what they've got in because i haven't been to either of those shops in what feels like forever i think it was pre-lockdown maybe so yeah gonna do a little bit of shopping today but i'm not gonna be too long i think it's gonna rain today hoping it's gonna rain um but i'm just going to do the parking have you got loads of different parking apps in your um in your local town because oh, we have so many different ones i'm only going to do an hour because i'm not going to need longer than that for primark i am going to be wearing a mask and i've just tried it on and i've got a disposable one today um because you can hear me better through this and also it's been so warm it's just a bit lighter um and more comfortable to wear so i'm going to wear this one today right let's go i haven't been into bournemouth for a little while because it's been so warm that everybody just wants to come to the beach which I don't blame them, but as a local, it's like the last place you want to be, Bournemouth Beach. It's just so busy, but kind of looking forward to popping into Primark today. Right, let's go in. I'm not gonna to touch anything that I don't intend to like potentially buy or check the price tag off. I just thought we'd have a little look. I do like these nice big baggy shirts. They're quite nice to wear on a hot day, aren't they? over a bikini oh i like that green actually i do like green that's a very simple dress but it's very nice just like plain white they do black and beige as well i've got some more dresses here that one's very pretty like that i absolutely love that bag with the longer handle so i assume it would fit on your shoulder I do like the black one too but that is nice i really like the cozy knit cardigan they have on those tank tops up there as well version but i love that that's so sweet I like all these colors that's pretty the mints and the pinks very nice i always like to look at the disney stuff harry potter we've got an up t-shirt disney pixar tea um another up one Mm, I don't have a lot. Some Winnie the Pooh stuff over here. That's very cute. A little consideration, a little thought for others makes all the difference, Eeyore. Oh, Ooh, this looks cosy though. I like those trackies. I bought those mini ears the other week. They're actually really nice, the red and white ones. Oh, I like a denim dress. Oh, black. Black denim dress, that's nice. This Andrew Fitzsimmons. Tester products not available. Wow, they look nice, don't they? I wonder how much they are. Oh, I can see the hair dries £12. Mm, interesting. I always like to see what Disney pyjamas they have in. I'm not hugely in love with any. They've got a nice like, loungewear section here. They're quite cute though, the grey Mickey Mouse ones. This mug. I don't need any more mugs, but I love that mug. Mickey Mouse one. This tablecloth is really nice. And they have loads of like outdoor picnic stuff lunch bags very nice oh look poo range oh my god that's adorable so this is what i wanted to come and see they've got some lovely homeware stuff love this i really like this big plant i want it <laughs> got loads of cute ones i love that i'm so glad i didn't waste any makeup this morning so i'm not wearing any it would have melted straight off my face but primark's now done and i wasn't overly impressed with much of the clothing selection there wasn't anything that i picked up apart from some more pants so yeah i'll show you all the homeware bits i bought when we get home but i'm gonna go to matalan and dunelm next because i think they're next door to each other from memory all right next stop is matalan okay already at the very front of the store i've seen these little plant pots and i love them how adorable are they i'm gonna wait and go to the home section see if they have more because they look lovely on display there so i'll just leave those ones 
we'll go have a look. There's nothing too exciting clothes wise. It's quite busy in here, so I'm trying not to film people, but loads of holiday stuff on offer. Wow, crazy. All right, this is what we want. The home store. Oh, <laughs> yes, I like it all already. It's not my cup of tea, but I do really like these. How cute are they? Animals. Oh, on the other side they have matching bigger ones. Oh, I like the blue over there, but before we go over there, look at these plants. Fake plants, flowers. Let's have a look. Oh, yes. That's nice. Oh, I love it. These will look really nice in an office. Loads of notes on. I also really love, I like, I've got a thing for mustard at the moment. Going into autumn, all these lovely colours. Home is where the dog lives. This is true. Very true. That one's nice as well. I love that actually. Ooh, that's a nice mirror. Love all these open shelves at the moment. Welcome back to oh. Oh, that's so cute. Oh my goodness. They have so many good things in. Oh, wow. I love it. These are so cute. Oh my god, I'm so obsessed. I've already got one of the spotty ones. I really want all of them, but do I need all of them? <laughs> More fake plants. I really want a really big one. And I'm looking at the stands they have, but I don't know if I want black. It's for the corner of my spare room where I film. Hmm, I love it all though. Okay, we're going into kitchen and also pets. Oh my god. Fun fact, this is actually why I bought Bonnie's first blankets before I even got her. Guys, I'm gonna have to stop vlogging because I can't carry everything. <laughs> oh, let's just have a look at the mugs though. Oh yes, we like a good mug. Oh, that one's nice. There's so many good things in here. Okay, that was very successful shop in Matalan. I got loads of bits and loads of things that I think will look really lovely around our house. So that was great. Definitely spent a hundred pounds in there. But we're gonna move on to Dunelm because the last thing I need to get is some placemats. We only have two, which I've been using because there's two of us, but my mum and my stepdad are coming over for dinner tonight. So I actually want to get fresh ones anyway like new ones some sort of set I'm not quite sure what I want I don't want hard boards and I don't want them like they had some really nice ones in there but they were a circle which I think could be nice but I do actually prefer <laughs> a rectangle shape wow just cooling down before I go in Dunelm I just moved my car closer so I was right by the entrance <laughs> oh aircon thank god I have aircon okay it's been a while since I've been in here as well don't need too much more now because I've got most of the bits and bobs I wanted at Mathlan, but you never know. I'm obsessed with all these little plants. That's nice down there. I like this if it didn't have chips in it. I quite like this little globe. I think that would look really nice in our lounge. I found the globe in black and silver, which I quite like. That's a lovely side table. They actually have some really nice furniture in here. Benj and I were looking in here when we needed furniture. That's a nice sofa actually, isn't it? I love this range. We already have this in our bathroom but they sell a bin and a toilet brush set which looks really nice matches like it don't need anything for the bathroom but I'm just well I do need to do the downstairs bathroom at some point but well like that hmm but not today basically <laughs> okay we're looking for mats but that's very sweet oh I love that placemats is what we want. I like this country heart white dinner set range. Look at that, with the little hearts. Okay, see this is obviously a trend right now because they also have the circle ones in here. I do like these a bit more though. They're really nice. And then these ones are quite nice and these ones have got little bees on. I can't believe I'm being so indecisive on placemats. But I want to see how big they are, like open them up and stuff. I can't do that. I really want to invest in a slow cooker and also Benji wants an air fryer so we're looking at getting those sort of things maybe close to Christmas. I've always been obsessed with the Joseph Joseph ranges and I don't know why. I just love the products and the branding. It's just lovely. Oh darling, is it raining? Do you not like the thunder? 
Do you not like the thunder? If you don't own this fan from Amazon already, you're missing out. Genius. Oh, it's like 30,000 degrees in here. So we're just gonna whiz through what I bought so I can put it away and show you. So we'll start with Dunelm because I didn't get a bag from there. Boring, but I bought a wok, a pan, stir fry pot thing. I've realized over the years since moving out that it actually pays to invest in decent pots. So this was 23 pound from Teffel, but I've bought cheaper ones and they just don't cook things as well. They don't clean as well. So that's the first thing we needed that. That was on my list. Saw these ice cube tray thing, but they're long sticks and I only have the cubes right now. And I thought these would be good for my water bottles. This was two pounds. Then I bought a spatula, spatula, um, the rubber silicon ones. Ours broke, so I had to get one of those as well. I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm actually very tempted to go and stand in the rain. Next, I bought this fake plant pot. I bought a shelving unit from B&M a few weeks ago, and I wanna put it up in the kitchen, and I was looking for some bits and bobs to put on that unit, so I wanted one of these hanging plants. I've got a few of these from Ikea, but they're much bigger, the Ikea ones. Um, so yeah, I love this. This was seven pounds. String of pearl plant. I'll leave a link below if I can find links. I'll leave links. The last thing I bought from Dunelm was this little cushion. It's got little bees on it. It's a square seat pad. It was eight pounds. And basically we don't have any garden furniture yet. And well, I like to go and sit in the garden with Bon and play with her and chuck her a ball and whatever. And our decking, is really bad and it's all rotting away and I keep getting splinters so I've had to put shoes at the back and I don't particularly want to sit on the decking without a little pillow so <laughs> I know it's such a niche weird thing um, but I just wanted something that I could use for the garden so I got that okay let's go on to Primark Ugh. How did I get so much stuff from Primark? I saw this a few weeks ago in Primark and I couldn't stop thinking about it so I went back to get it. It was £10 and it's just fake flowers in a jug but I just thought that was so lovely. I think this will look really nice on the kitchen table. Like I know it's fake and it looks fake. Like I'm just not fussed about that but I think it looked really nice. I did also buy this tray for £4.50 and I don't know... Oh, dear, that's going to fall over. I don't know if it will look any good, but I thought it could look quite nice to have like a little tray on the table, maybe a candle. I don't know, Primark Home is actually quite nice. So yeah, got those bits. I got this little plant and I thought I could put water in the vase so it looks a little bit more real, but this was six pounds and I just, I just liked it. I just thought that was really nice. I went a bit fake plant mad, didn't I? Did I get more? Oh, I got more in, um, Matalan. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Very boring, but for one pound, I got a doorstop, just a pack of two. Just quite handy because Bonnie doesn't like if doors are like slamming or if they're like half ajar, she won't go through them. So I try and keep the doors open for her. The last thing from Primark is really boring, um, but it's a bulls set. I love this game and we play this a lot when we go to the beach or like Benji's grandparents have a set. It was super cheap, two pound. So I just thought, I saw it and I thought, well, it was originally four pound, but it was in the sale for two. And you know, when you see something, you're like, that'd be so much fun at the weekend. Um, if we have like a barbecue, play games, whatever. I thought that'd be good. So I got that as well, a bit random, but fun. If you've seen the film Wild Child, I've got myself a Sula. Sweaty up a lip alert. <laughs> I can't believe I'm filming when it's like this. If I don't film, I won't upload though, so, you know. Next, I went to Matalan, as we know, went a bit mad. So, the first thing I got was this little basket, and it was £14. I've owned various baskets like this over the years, but I specifically wanted it for the back door for our sliders. <laughs> Both Benji and I have sliders and flip-flops at the back door, to um, take Bonnie outside into the garden and it's quite handy to have them in a little basket so we can grab them. They look a bit like messy lined up at the back door so I thought I'd chuck them in here and then we always have shoes to put on when we need to take her outside. So got that. Another fake plant, who knew? Eight pound, love it. You saw me talk about this. I actually really liked the other one as well but I thought I was going a bit mad so I had to calm down. So I got that. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. 
might look quite nice on the side tables who knows i also got this one <laughs> Now, they did actually have this in a blue pot as well, like a blue and white, but in our lounge we've got like grey and mustards. I basically want to hang it in the lounge somehow. I really love it. It was £10. I just think it looks so nice. Along with the same like colour scheme, I just picked up this little blanket because this is the colours that we have in the lounge, this mustard yellow grey white so saw this extra blanket six pound we use a blanket up on the sofa if bonnie's up on the sofa with us so although i have one for her me and benj they all seem to be rotating around in various places or in the wash so i thought i'd get another spare one and i'll chuck that in the ottoman puff thing we have the next thing i got was a bit spontaneous and i'm not really sure if it's kind of our decor and colors in the kitchen but you know when you see something you're like, I absolutely love it. I just had to have it. It was £12 and it's a hand painted jug. And I'm going to fill this with cold water and loads of ice. And when my family come over for dinner tonight, I'm going to have water that they can pour from a jug. I love it. I think it's really nice. You could put some fake plants in it or real flowers in it. But no, I'm going to use it for water. I did buy some clothes in uh, Matalan. This little top, not that this is homeware, but you know it's got a zigzag back this was £12.50 I really lack t-shirts sorry my neighbour does MOTs and car stuff out, out there anyway and then I saw this one in the sale for £2 little stripy tank top which I'm going to wear with a pair of shorts the next things are pet bits now a couple of weeks ago on the Matalan website I ordered this really cute little treats tin i keep bonnie's dental sticks in here they're like a perfect size so i got her that and then in store today i saw this and if you know me you'll know i constantly say bits and bobs so i had to have this with a little paw print on and i'm going to use this for grooming products her hair brushes her um tablets and shampoos and all sorts it's a pet caddy i just think it's so adorable look at that I absolutely love Matalan for pet stuff actually. I never thought it would be a place that, that did good pet stuff, but we bought a few bits from Bonnie there. Um, so the other thing I picked up was a pet towel. This was five pounds. And when we go to the beach or we go on a forest walk and she goes in the river, she gets wet, um, we constantly carry beach towels with us for her, like specific towels for her, but they're quite heavy. So I just wanted a few more microfiber, smaller towels I can chuck in a bag and this one just kind of looked quite perfect. Um, so five pound for a pet towel, perfect. And then I also got her a bed. Now she has so many beds, so many, but the one that was in my office is now between Benji's car and the kitchen. And I just loved the bone on this, the gray. This side is like more of a beige, um, but it was only 10 pounds. And I just think it's really snuggy and cute. Here you go, Bon. Can I sit down? It's hard to know with Bon if she'll actually sit on it, but for a tenner, I thought it could be quite handy. So got that. And then the only other thing I got, just because there was so much stuff, was this massive dog reusable bag. And this was three pounds. I absolutely love this. How cute. So yeah, that is everything I bought. I'm gonna go and put all this stuff away now. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what piece you liked best. If you've bought anything nice from any homeware shops recently or online, let me know. And I will see you again very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.